and a rematch of last year's Supers in Knoxville. And the first offering, 67 miles per hour, 1-0. and And smacks that through the right side, base hit. First strikeout for Gutierrez. Six hole. And the leadoff for the senior out of Wiley, Texas. Digit runs last weekend. Scott reaches for it. The only play for Gibson is at first. Dayton advances to second. It's good as a sacrifice. So here's the matchup with Atwood. Opposite over the head of Nugent. And a run will score for Texas. The RBI double and Atwood's back continues to smoke. Well, and when you know the side of the plate it's coming on, watch Reese Atwood. Beautiful job of keeping her hands close to her body so that her barrel can get to this. Going opposite field on a pitch that's middle in, and Texas scores first. Played for the national championship a couple of years ago. And a strikeout of Vivi, but a run in the national semifinals. A strikeout to get Pooney one down. Out there as well. Wait, wait, wait. Just like that. There she goes. Wait, wait, wait. Run, run, run. Single for Destiny. Needs to be off the plate a little bit more. First pitch swinging. And double play for the Texas defense. That'll erase the base hit. Punch out for Pickens, looking. Henry laying down the butt. Safe at first. Infield single. 3-1 pitch. Draws the walk, passes the bat to the top of the order. in the dirt, runners will move up 60 feet. Two in scoring position now for Dayton. Ground ball to short, mishandled by Fall, and a run will score. Another two strike swing. I mean, this is where Texas is so good. First to get the runners on base with two outs, but then you add on two strikes, hit the ball hard. Yes, it is right to Bella Fa, but it's hit hard enough, takes that last hop. Scott, skies that one out to Malloy in center, under it for the third out. Chopped down to third, bobbled by Scott. And panel is safe. Same destination, which is Oklahoma City. And a strikeout for Gutierrez, one down. And gloved by Scott, she'll go the short way to get the lead runner, two down. In for a strike, the throw down. What a throw by Atwood. Good take. Lead off base runner. <laughs> <laughs> a rocket, but caught it short by Thaw. And diving back in safely is Stewart. One down. Well, he didn't win it. Swing and a miss for Pickens. That's strikeout number three. Two down. Jolie Mitchell. And the runner will be able to advance on the pass ball. Runners up that allowed that second run to score. Moving up again. Well, it looks like that was scored a wild pitch and probably this one too. So that would be three yep. here in the first three innings. Pops up on Rodriguez. She'll get the out at first. 
pops her up. Oh, and that'll drop in fair. Was it touched before it ricocheted foul? And it appeared there might have been Riley. a collision between West and Mitchell. Well, she's, yeah, and she's already touched first base, so does that matter? No, I, and I think it hit the defender first, so. I, did it hit, did it hit her glove? It looked like. No contact between the two. I don't know that it hit her glove. So far with a runner on base, Gibson trying to change that. A deep blast back to the track and now circling back onto the grass for the catch for Caden Henry as well. That one gets by Atwood and Riley West over into scoring position. Waving West around, and Texas won't even try for her at the plate. Tennessee's on the board. RBI single, Nugent. Saw her fall off so many pitches in away. And this is a mistake left up in the zone. We've seen that beautiful drop, that spin that goes down. This one hangs up, and Nugent takes advantage. Hardest hit ball we've seen from Tennessee to get him on the board. Brings the go-ahead run to the plate. Wrapped right back up the middle. Oh, oh, oh. To Washington. The backhand to first, and they're saying the runner was safe at second base. Did she miss the bag? Oh, man, because this was a sweet play. The bare hand. I mean, she had me out of my chair. Watch her grab this bare hand. She's out. Whoa, not even close. Yeah. Her foot is on the bag. I mean, <laughs> this is a great play. Are they saying she was juggling it with her foot off the base or something here? I mean, her foot, but she's got it right there. Yeah. And she's got to get out of the way. Yeah, that's, that's an out. And there's no replay review. Slow roll, that'll be trouble. Nowhere to go for Mia Scott and there's runners on the corners. Slow roller to third. Scott with time over to first to get that pitch to the batter. Face knock through the left side for Caden Henry, her second single of the night. Base hit, this one through the right side. Two on with one out, top of the order. Runner goes and sliding in safely at third is Henry. And right behind her, Maloney will move up a bag. Hit her, so she's got that lane wide open. Infield in, they'll make the play at home. Rodriguez with the throw, and they got her. Henry out at the plate. Two down. That is a great job by Rodriguez in that second base position. Another one to the right side, and Rodriguez makes the play to first. <laughs> <laughs> it's El Nino. Yeah! Ooh, ooh. Base hit. <laughs> Just out of sort so far today for Malloy. Right back to Gutierrez. Out of Stewart. So now started out the season on a six game hitting streak with that hit earlier, but another strikeout for Pickens back to back. Let's see if he makes any adjustments. Carlin Pickens striking out the side in the bottom of the fifth. And there's a base hit. Nugent, second single. Two to Pooney. Two down. Invitational website to check on when and if those games can be played with a lot of rain expected tomorrow. So. Texas play to run. Thaw checks the runner, goes to first and safe. 
Good speed for Henry down the line. Here's Ashton Maloney. Drops down a beaut of a bunt. They'll get her at first, but the sacrifice pushes two Longhorns into scoring position. Reaches out for it, and Rodriguez has it at second. Couple left on. 65. <laughs> <laughs> with another strike at that six, two down. Base hit, and Tennessee will get Kiki Malloy to the plate as the go-ahead run now in the seventh inning. Chopped to short, this could do it, over to first, in time. Gutierrez holds Malloy in check, and that'll end it, two to one, Texas a winner over Tennessee.